Hmm. What is going on, Taurus? This is Jen catching you on DCWJ Life. Hope you're all having a great day. This is the last season that I'm going to be shooting like this. Welcome to Virgo season. <laughs> it's the end of the summer, the beginning of autumn. It's like kind of like a cusper as far as seasons is concerned, that sign. Yeah. <laughs> it's pretty cool. I like it. So I'm going to see what's going on with you guys after shuffling the cards. Yeah, you're no longer going to be getting my this background. Nefertiti's always going to say what's up, though. <laughs> That's cool. Don't worry about it. <laughs> yeah. Let's see what's cooking good looking. My beautiful Taurus. All my beautiful bulls out here. Let me know how you're doing. Seriously. Love you guys. Let's see what's cooking. Absolutely. Ah. Not a hundred sure, not hundred on it. I don't know. Do da, do da. Let me find out because I don't know. Oh, do da day. Whoa. <laughs> yes, Taurus. Uh, let's see what is cooking. Good making. Okay. Yeah, at the bottom of the deck we have plant upright. So it seems like a semblance of balance is happening within your, uh, all of your pragmatics, all of your earthly matters. Like, you're kind of balancing out anything. It could be balancing out a checkbook. Okay, you're balancing out all kinds of stuff that's going on as it pertains to all that is material or financial. Or both. So let's see what's cooking. What is going on for Taurus during Virgo season? Anything positive, please let me know. Thank you. <laughs> okay. This is fun. I just, just love how that happens. Okay. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. I see. Okay. Give me a second. Just got to get these things together here. I'm doing five cards. Uh, I got three laid out and the first and the third clarified. So first card coming up is Storm Upright. If it'll come into focus, that'd be fabulous. And it is, it is coming into focus. Definitely you are looking at a mindset, mindset shift. Why do I want to say mindset? I did that twice just now. For the love of goddess and God, why? Anyway, <laughs> <laughs> Coming in fivefold, which denotes a sense of direction happening. Your sense of direction is changing. Okay. It's a hot topic for certain. Absolutely. People are talking about it. Yeah, they are. I don't know if they're talking about that positively or negatively, but it sure is a freaking hot topic, man. You are making moves, Taurus. Beautiful, man. Good job. Uh, second card coming up is the one that showed up at the bottom of the deck, which is playing upright coming in twofold. This may have to do with two people as well, you and another person, trying to work on things, trying to work on manifesting uh, something that is pragmatic to get it rolling, to get it coming through, to build upon it. It's number two, not four, so it's not exactly stable yet, but it will get there because your mind just shifted. Give it time. Be patient. Third card coming up is hang man upright. <gasps> Sold. Anyway, <laughs> yeah. Um, hanged man upright, most definitely coming in twelvefold. I would really like to see fulfillment in this, because the number tw uh, the number twelve symbolizes fulfillment here, and this says I'm the knowledge of my inquiry. You're getting what you asked for. All right, Taurus. Either way it goes, my love, you are getting exactly what you asked for. All right. Clarifying that is breath up right here. Yeah. And this is you. This is how you're responding to getting everything that you're asking for. You're either fighting somebody, the second person, over pragmatics or some type of wealth. You're you, like you're fighting with somebody over that. Or you're communicating more assertively. Because maybe there are things that are not changing that really should. And you're not exactly the type to be a stick in the mud. You want things to keep moving. I'm really getting that. Uh, Babu. Let me see what else is coming out for you. All right. Aha. 
Yeah, I knew that was going to happen. I freaking knew it. You got Ozone up right. Coming in fourfold. Um, that's also an error card. May as well pick it up while I'm talking about it. <laughs> that um, mindset shift that uh, you're experiencing is actually coming in fourfold, which means that it is, it is stable. It is sound. Okay. It's not like you're planning on anything insane. You're actually growing on something. All right. That's freaking beautiful. I like it. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. Taurus. I love it. I do. I love it. Uh, quake upright is the second card coming in another one, five fold five and five right here is effing beautiful. Check it out, man. This is you all the way. Yeah, things are changing, but you're a little bit disappointed in something, and I think that kind of links up with uh, Breath Upright, and that's the reason why you are communicating more assertively, because there are things that are disappointing you that are not changing, and you're like, why? I'm over here getting old, and things are still not changing. Uh, I'm not happy. <laughs> you know, like, why? <laughs> Third card coming up. <laughs> Shaman and Will Inverted, man. Forget it. Things have not come in full circle yet. Ninefold inverted. This is frustrating the shit out of you, dude. Absolutely it is. I can't... Oh, hello. And it, it just, like, flipped around and turned upright, saying the universe is on your side. Don't worry. Because it says, in my weakness, do not forsake me. Do not be afraid of my power. Yeah, as soon as I was collecting the cards, it flipped. Uh, yeah, you're going to be okay. You made me feel like you made me feel like you you're getting old and uh, you know a little frustrated, waiting for things to change. Stop waiting for things to change. Take action. You're gonna be fine. Holy cow! Oh yeah. All right. <laughs> I like doing that. It's fun. Um. All right. What else is going on? Okay. Here we go. Ah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. There is no new opportunity, so it's best to just start working on this now. <laughs> okay, don't pu don't put it off. This is the two inverted thing. It is the procrastination? Okay, that plant card upright coming in twofold, balancing things out, manifesting. Focus on that. Stop procrastinating. Okay, it's not entirely up to the other person to make changes. You also play a part in that. Okay. Holy cannoli and a big crap bowling. I'm shocked over here. We got judgment and forgiveness upright. You're feeling entrapped or like, you know, you're incarcerated in a way. Um, like you're just bound to like this contract that you no longer want to be a part of. Cause, oh, shit. But it is the ultimate judgment. You can't escape it coming in 20 fold. I'm the one who cries out and I listen. I am the knowledge of my name. Okay. So you're, you're pretty much working on rising above the the visual and the feeling of being incarcerated by this particular thing. This could be to a cancer because you got Empress upright. Okay, it's possible. I'm not saying definitively. But a person with that type of energy, no matter what sun sign they are, with this type of energy, okay? Yeah. That person may be the reason why you feel the way that you do about a certain situation, or they could be there to support you throughout the whole thing. Okay. Like they're basically your get, your get out of jail free card, right? They're helping you out. Okay. Yeah. You know, that could be the thing. Taurus, let me know what's going on in the comments. I'm serious because this is freaking weird, dude. You got to learn how to like, you, you need to relearn is what it is, how to, Bust through that like a bull through a china shop, man. Just be, yes, be tired of it, but do something about it. <laughs> I love you guys. I do. I love you guys. Um, I wanted to let you know that I have a goal right now uh, for Patreon. I'm looking for 15 people to join me within uh, the first tier, which is um, a, a very safe secure community. Any comments that you leave on the content they're in is private, not publicized. This way, all discussions are kept safe. Um, ideas can be shared. People can learn. You can learn. You can grow. Okay. I'm getting back into teaching within that, uh, tier. 
I'm teaching metaphysics and uh, about the occult. Also, I, I would deliver to you one reading per month automatically. There is no contract included. Um, I'm also going to be writing about basic life skills um, that I have learned from my grandparents, from my parents. You know, it goes down the line, my ancestors. So I'd be more than happy to share all of that with you. Uh, definitely check everything out in the description of this video. Also go to, uh, it's going to be in the description, but my Patreon homepage, you're going to see on my, uh, in my bio who I am, what I'm about, and you can decide from there, discern from there whether I'm for you or I'm not. Until then, thank you for subscribing. Much love and light to you all. Bless a big.